Um, I think it, the first year is always going to be a bit difficult in terms of trying to find your feet and things like that, but I was aware that it was quite a kind of free timetable that allows us to work when we needed to work and be in when we were required to be in. Yeah, it, it was something that I adjusted to quite quickly um, and kind of suits a creative person, I think, as well, the flexibility of it. I was just expecting a, a kind of place where I was able to be kind of free and explore all the ideas that I wanted to in a kind of free environment amongst other creative individuals. Um, yeah, a, a kind of space as well, which was the way that Portfolio of course really helped me um, in kind of challenging the way that I'd been thinking before and almost unlearning some of the things that had been kind of drummed into me through the conventions of school and the kind of education system. My expectations of art school initially when I'd been in high school were that it was somewhere that you went to do what people told you to do. Like I thought that in art you just, someone told you to draw an apple and you had to make, draw an apple that looked like an apple and that's what turned me off to it initially and that's why it took me such a long time to sort of come back round to the idea. I think everyone works through it in quite different ways and interprets things in their own way so like drawing doesn't always mean the same thing to everyone. Um, I quite like working in a 3D way where there's people who enjoy working in 2D and I think it's important just to focus on what makes your work better and continue to work like that and not get too bogged down in other people's ways of working. I think there's two main extremes of crits. One of them being up nice, like Rob said, and the other being too uh, strict, like yes or no. So like we need to, I always keep in mind that these are very constructive comments about the subject. Subject is the project. So I shouldn't take it personally. I shouldn't learn to take it personally. I should synchronize with the lecturers to a language that is helping the project to grow as well. So it's about taking in and thinking the comments later on. My teachers all went to art school um, and they said it was really, really good and that it would be a really good experience and it has been really, really good. Um, it's kind of everything they've said has, has sort of happened. Um, they just sort of said it would be really quite immersive um, and you would kind of find yourself maybe. Um, and I think that is, um, as cliche as it sounds, that has sort of, sort of been true. I really, really like Glasgow actually. I think it's quite, it's got sort of its own rugged charm, <laughs> which um, which I think is nice and it's got kind of a mix of people and it's, I think it's a good place to make work. Um, it's kind of rich in lots of different kinds of life and, and spaces and that sort of thing. So, so if there was, a, there was something that I have to say is don't be scared, <laughs> you know, things will work out fine. Just, you know, be open to people be open to a new series, new education, and push yourself as much as possible, as far as you can in the design room, and do your best. I think different to what I expected is everyone's nicer, and it's not as scary. Like, uh, there's so many stories about GSA, about like everyone's really up themselves, and they all think they're like the best, and they're gonna be like really hard on you, and you're gonna, yeah just that sort of stories I think you hear from people that didn't have a good time here, but they're all lying. <laughs> it was great. <laughs>